Okay, this is going to be for Capricorn. For Capricorn. somebody juggling if they want to get married or not. They're up in their head. They still feel their pinnacles are small that they're building. But they do want to offer love. Just maybe not marriage at this time. Eventually. Yeah. Eventually. And it's going to be a regular reading. Capricorn, but you need to worry about having a tower. You need to offer them something. So that is you. These cards don't want to act right for you, Cappy. <clears throat> See, not being up in your head anymore. Alright, Spirit says go with it. You have the Eight of Cups in reverse, Temperance, the King of Wands in reverse, the Hermit, and the Page of Wands in reverse. What is going on? I don't know what that card was. <laughs> On the bottom of the deck was this. It was in there. So maybe your answer is to wait. Or let go. <laughs> I was wondering where that card was. in reverse two of cups let me get one on that temperance and then we'll get one I guess one on each a wheel of fortune ten of cups in reverse the empress in reverse swords in reverse. Alright, let me get one on the Wheel of Fortune. Page Pentacles. Let me get one on the Page of Pentacles. Three of Swords. Third Party. Broken Heart. The Lovers. Let me get one on the Lovers. Ten of Cups. Let me get two for the overall. Well, you really cut my work out for me today. And you got more than two for the overall. Your strength is in the negative. Your empire is in the negative. And your queen of wands is in the negative. Wow. Okay. What I see here is... Either you or your partner has had an affair... It is broken up. Your cup of love is broken up. <clears throat> Anything about you moving forward. No matter of fact, you're moving in reverse at this present time. You can always change that. You have free will. Um, you're pretty pissed off. They're getting your money. I see you actually crying over your money more than 
this to a cups. Yeah. He is not giving you any love, and your third party is not giving you any love. The other third party. So, apparently, what I say is it's you that's had the third party. Possibly with a Virgo or a Taurus, or you were hoping that the Taurus would just chill out and wait, but they're not going to wait. They're moving on. Yeah, they're moving on. They're not staying around. They're moving on, and they're going to find their Ten of Cups elsewhere. A happy Ten of Cups at that, so. You cheated for no reason. <sighs> you don't have the strength. You're upset about not being the one. You're upset about them not being the one. You're not really upset about the one you were with, the one you were married to, the one that you cheated on. You are, you're upset about the one that left you, the third party that came in. You are upset about them. Okay. What do they need to do? What do they need to do? It's the Pentacles and the Seven of Cups. So your dreams and desires need to work on your dreams and desires. Stop worrying about relationships. But apparently you, you've lost your money in the divorce. Maybe your home. I don't see any kids here, so... Give me one more. Yeah, you're gonna have to work harder. I know you worked hard before to get what you got, but you had a, an affair. So now you're going to have to work hard to make your dreams come true. Whatever you want in these cups, you're gonna have to you're gonna have to work harder to make it happen. All right, let me get through my other cards for Capricorn. Capricorn, I'm sorry to hear about that. Okay, you want to go away out there. Path unknown. Oh, not yet. Okay. Pull that one. Archangel Raphael. Pull that one. And the waterfall in reverse. Alright, I'm going to have to read these for you because I know this one says one path you know, you frequent, you know one path, but there's multiple other ones you can take. It's your choice. It's up to you. <clears throat> Page 63. Of all the archangels, Raphael's the most often comes in the disguise of a human. This card can indicate that helpful others may be attending you now. It also portends a time of great achievement in your personal life, and Raphael is opening the door. Blessings abound with this card upright. There may be a renewal of a lost dream, or reunited of family members, or healing, perhaps a physical condition of a broken heart, or a broken heart. Even these conditions have been hanging on for a while now. It is time when you can really break through. Now is the time when you can really break. Let Raphael be your partner in this process, and you'll soon see why they call him the miracle worker. All you got going on there, yeah. But, you know, it looks like it's ended. Waterfall. I mean, I don't see an ending card, but because you haven't let go. But it looks like the others have let go. The waterfall. Let's find the waterfall. Where is it at? What is that? Six of horses. Page 
page 176. Okay, it's in reverse. Reverse, this card indicates a situation where you're feeling a significant loss of power. Yep, that emperor in reverse right up there in the strength. And the queen of wands. This water ball refers to show that you're in an emotional reactive time. You may feel like your life's turned totally upside down and you may have unintentional giving your power to someone else. Whether it's love, a boss, a family member, or a friend, perhaps you are following another person's agenda in spite of your own intu intuition not to do so. In a more extreme form, you may have completely given up, falling into depression, or living according to dictates of others. It's imperative that you rise up and take your power back. It may seem foreign for you. Stop it! It may seem foreign for you to do so, but it's a lesson that your soul longs for to learn. During this phase, take time and your meditation and restful states to tap the love, power, and value of your spirit. When you understand your true value, you will know that you deserve to carve out your own destiny. And you'll take the steps to do so. Yeah, that's what I see there. Everybody else in this relationship, whether it be your wife that you just got divorced from or getting divorced from, your mistress, or vice versa, or, you know, if it's you're a woman and this is you, they all have let go. They've let go. It's your turn to let go. You need to let go. All right, give me give me a couple more cards for Capricorn here on this. What do they need to do? I know they need to let go, but you know what what what's a bound for them after that? King of Pentacles. That's you. Page of Cups. And you need to choose the path. You can either choose the path of war or you can choose the path of righteousness you're going to have a friend come in or a family member and they're going to offer some help they're going to be genuine they're going to help you you can either choose the path of war or righteousness do they help you with your war or did they help you to get back on your feet and you to be righteous? Alright Capricorn, that is for April 20th through May 4th. Blessings to you. Uh, I don't know how all these cards get upside down. Where is the button? There it is.